that part that all says, this is a tent, we're in a place called Italy, you're a male, you're a female, you're a certain, right, okay. that's our consensual reality. Those are the rules you were given from the moment of conception and probably even beyond, where you were taught and trained to be who you are based upon the lineage that you come from, the genetic family that you come from, the culture that you come from. You were imbued in your mother's body, the, the birth mother's body, of a certain level of experience of who she was, which then translated into who you were. Because when babies are first born, the first few years, they cannot differentiate between me and that. We are we. We are one. And so if there's trauma that happens to the mother, oftentimes the child has carried it. If there's trauma that happened in the family, in the lineage, it's carried within the cells of your DNA. And it's only waiting to be activated by the certain circumstances that align, that allow that activation to occur. So for example, some people we were talking, I do a lot of work with birth and pregnancy and, and, and the transformation that occurs during birth. There may have been a trauma or there may have been a schism that happened in the genetic family lineage or the cultural family lineage or the individual lineage of that individual that doesn't become activated until she becomes pregnant and now has to realize that her sexual trauma is suddenly like hugely activated in her second chakra. Or that her, or, or that her mother's trauma or that her grandmother was a child bride at 13 has now played a part with her circumstances and her challenge. But the circumstances didn't come into alignment until they all did, the stars aligned, and then suddenly the trauma was activated. So we are this amalgam of all these different places, all these different states. We are not just one. One size will never fit all. Are we in agreement? Yes. Okay, awesome. Thank you for that. So one of the things that I really like to engender at the beginning of class is because I don't teach your class. I ask the divine to teach your class. Thank you, Sakina. I ask the divine to teach your class. So in my practice, what I was always taught is that we tune in. Who's the Kundalini in the room? Is there a Kundalini in the room? Who of you guys practice Kundalini? Yeah, you're a Kundalini, you're a Kundalini. So you know we connect to the golden chain of the teachers, right? I'm a Kundalini yogi. We tune in. We connect to the divine lineage of the teachers. Because otherwise I'm teaching from my ego, which is great, but not all that great. Or we're going to be teaching from the lineage of the teachers. And so I will also speak to your lineage of your teachers who brought every single one of you here because you are not here by accident. What I would posit is that each and every one of you, from the moment of your conception, every step of the path along the way has brought you to this moment. And we've all had this incredible diversity of paths. Had you done one thing differently, you might not be here. You might be in Timbuktu on a sailing yacht, having an affair with some really hot person. <laughs> and that might still be in your pictures, and now that I've planted that idea. <laughs> I wish that for you. <laughs> But at the same time, you also have this great diversity of self that you bring to yourself. And part of that sense of self that we have brought is from our historical legend, our legend of self. And so part of the conversation here is, and I'm going to invite you at your pleasure and at your depth of safety and security, which we will create and build. We're going to create this bubble of safety and security where you will actually feel free to go into that lineage and start to pull those pieces of richness forward into you now so that you can be on point. That you can start to tingle from every cell, every muscle, every fiber. That you can start to feel that tingle. It's already starting in the room. Anybody feel it in the room already downloading? Yeah. Okay. It's already started. So let that feeling start to grow. So I'm going to ask you to begin to tune in. So everybody, please close your eyes.